Hello, welcome to today's web class. This is Sumit 1, Unit 6. Let's talk about animals. Today's communication goals is exchange opinion about the treatment of animals. Another one, discuss the benefits of certain pets. Compare animal characters and debate the value of animal conservation. Okay, here we go. Well, first of all, our grammar goals is um, at first passive voice with models. Let's talk about it. Okay, so uh, here we are going to talk about can for the present possibility or ability. Example, alternatives can be found for medical research on animals. Remember that uh, whenever we use the passive voice, of course, we are going to have, first of all, the object, later on, verb to be in the required form, then we are going to need the main verb in past participle and later on maybe in the uh, next part that it's going to be the complement and later on the subjects okay if necessary now let's talk about might or might not and could for present or future possibility examples New medicines might be discovered through animal testing. Here we go again with the structure. First of all, we have verb to be with a model and the verb, the main verb in past participle. And so later on, the complement. Okay, let's go with some other examples and some other forms. Now we are going to talk about couldn't and can't for present impossibility. Example, researchers couldn't be done today without animals. Mm, I guess this is a mistake. Researches couldn't be done today without animals. Here we go again with the object. Uh, now, verb to be with modal auxiliars, the verb in past participle and the complement. All right. Now let's go with should and shouldn't for advisability. Example, corporate chicken farms should be shut down. Destructor, here we have the object. Uh, later on, the auxiliar model auxiliar with verb to be and the verb in past participle okay here we go with the next let's continue talking about the passive voice with models have to and most for necessity example some animals have to be killed example Traditions like bullfighting must be preserved. Um, I don't know, do you agree that traditions like bullfighting must be preserved or must be banned? Okay, this is a, a bone contention. This is a controversial point. Okay, so here, here they say that most is rarely used in the informal English. So it is uh, more mostly used for formal English. All right, let's go with the next. Yes, no questions. Okay, we are going to use the yes, no question with the passive. Examples. Can other types of research be found? Here we can see that, first of all, we have the auxiliar, later on, the verb to be, and at last, the verb in past participle. Let's continue. 
Here we have another example. Should factory farms be shut down? All right, here we can see again that first of all, we have the modal auxiliar later on the verb to be, and finally, the verb in past participle. Okay, next. In this example, we are going to use most. Must animals be used for research? And finally, do animals have to be used for research? As far as we know, they are called yes, no questions because the answer must be yes or no. Can other types of research be found? Yes, they can. Or no, they can't. Should factory farms be shut down? Yes, they should. Or no, they shouldn't. Must animals be used for research? Yes, they must. Or no, they mustn't. Do animals have to be used for research? Oh yes, they do. Or no, they don't. Okay, now let's clean the page so that we can change the image. Here we go. All right, pretty good. Now let's go with the next. Information questions. Uh, we call the information question to these constructions because we are going to use, first of all, a WH question that is requiring for information as an answer. For example, how can animals be trained to help humans? The answer must be, well, animals can be trained to help humans by a special program. Okay, so here the answer is no. Yes, they can or no, they can't. Okay, next question. What could be done to improve conditions? What do you consider that could be done? Well, um, it could be done any a new culture for people or, well, some other possibilities. Next, why must their lives be respected? Well, they must be respected because, and here you expose your reasons, Okay, let's go with the next. Uh, I'm sorry, let's go back. Be careful. Don't have to or doesn't have to express a lack of necessity, but most not expresses prohibition. The prohibition is expressed with don't have or doesn't have. In this case, uh, for example, animals don't have to kill to be killed for research. It is not necessary. Or animals must not be killed for research. It should be prohibited. Okay, now let's erase the markers. All right, now you can do it. Which animals do you think make good pets or bad pets? Why? Express your ideas, explain them. All right, well, we have finished with the contents in this unit. Thank you for watching this video. We hope that it has been useful for you. If you have any doubt, contact your tutor. Don't forget to solve the exercises and activities in the platform so that you can get better scores. Meet you at your conversation class. Have a great time.